the judge on that panel, I would be kind of irritated that you're questioning my integrity. Questions of favoritism over who made the cut for Sarah High School's cheer squad. 10 News reporter Steve Fiorina is live at the school. And Steve, in the past hour, you just got reaction from the principal. We did. The uh, cheerleading, as you know, is just as competitive as football, baseball, and sometimes parents get more involved than just supporting their kids. That's what happened here at Sarah High School. The cheerleaders are an integral part of high school sport. At Sarah High School, controversies erupted over the selection of next year's cheer squad. 75 girls recently tried out. 24 were chosen for varsity, 24 for junior varsity. Parents of some of those not chosen complained of favoritism. They said that the judges were favoring um, some of the Cougar parents. The Cougars being a club team in Tierra Santa, there was history with some girls. Complaints were made to the principal. He was receiving law uh, letters from lawyers and upset parents. I just feel it's crazy to get the lawyers involved. Tryouts are being done over with a panel of NCAA judges. The NCAA judges, uh, and we'll have five of them, that will be totally unbiased. Marco Franco says he's not worried. To me, she's an excellent cheerleader, you know, and I have no doubt in my mind that she will make it. Anna First is confident too. No, she will make it again because she's very good at it. There's more, which should please most involved. Instead of just being exclusive with the cheerleaders, we're being inclusive because we're creating a pep squad. So those cheerleaders uh, who may not make it will be able to be part of our new pep squad. And those tryouts will be on May 19th and all winners. Live in Tierra Santa, Steve mm -hmm. Fiorina, 10 News. We shall see. All right, thank you, Steve. 10 News first heard about this story from a viewer tip. If you have a story idea for us, email tips at 10news.com.